everyone, how's it going? And welcome back to the Minecraft Survival Let's Play. It has been such a long time since I've said that. And most importantly, let's forget about the past. I know it's been a few months of very uh, inactive, just no uploads, very, very low quality and everything. So, oh my gosh, I am so sorry. Uh, I've just been kind of scheduled up with a lot of things, you know, because of the holidays and, and college. But uh, I've kind of figured out what to do now. We kind of have a, an idea. Hopefully, we'll find out in a few months if this idea holds true. But... Uh, uh, yeah, we're finally back on the Minecraft Survival Let's Play, and I'm excited to continue this series. Many of you guys have been asking, what's up with this series? Is it dead? Will it continue? What is the plan with this? Well, I am going to continue it for sure. So uh, you guys can sit back and relax, and uh, uh, we're going to get started. Today, we're actually going to work on a food shop, which is one of the buildings back there, which we haven't even done anything with it. Uh, they've just been sitting and collecting dust pretty much. Uh, I do want to say one more thing. Thank you again for 50,000 subscribers. Honestly, I do not have a special uh, kind of made for that yet. Uh, I'm thinking of doing something in the next few days uh, for all of you and to kind of show my appreciation because it is a big milestone and I really do appreciate all the support everyone has been leaving and I kind of feel guilty for kind of the last few months being kind of inactive, not really giving guys quality content and not uploading as often as I should be. So uh, with that being said, I'm going to try my best to put like a collage or something together. If you have any other ideas though, please let me know uh, down below in the comment sections. I'd really appreciate that so without further ado let me stop the whole jibber jabber and let's get into this whole entire series um, and episode today so this building right here has been collecting tons of dust including this one as well even though this one does have stuff inside uh, it's empty it's supposed to be a potion room and we've never went to the to the freaking nether or anything we've never really done that um, I think we actually did go once in the episode but we haven't done anything uh, to the extent of actually fighting uh, other freaking mobs and such but uh, we're going to go ahead and we're going to work on this building right here. It's quite empty as you can see. And I'm pretty sure up there, that's not supposed to be a window. I think that's a pathway, uh, if I'm not mistaken. That is a pathway. Look at that. Oh, sweet. I think we can actually climb up here and just get ourselves right on top. So yeah, this is kind of the view I had in mind when I first created these buildings to kind of have a pathway going around. This right here is my armor room, which is very, very disappointing. So we're gonna have to fix this up because there's no armor in here. So it kind of just makes no point in calling this the armor room when there's just stands. <laughs> so yeah, let's forget about that. Uh, let's go ahead and uh, start working on this. First of all, the floor is looking disappointing. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna start off with the floor. Now, I wanna make as many buildings with as many themes as possible, storage room, this one is the armor room and we have so many other buildings to work on so in the meantime we're gonna work on this place and I think we're gonna just go with jungle wood uh, I think that's what we're doing with a lot of the interior here actually the interior is uh, a mix and match of everything so uh, all right well we'll just go ahead and actually hold on do we have any marble or do we have any other type of flooring colored clay oh sweet all right let's use some dark well, yeah let's do some gray and see if that actually looks kind of interesting for a food shop. So this food shop is pretty much going to be an area we can go ahead, grab like a, like a takeout and uh, take whatever we want from here. So that's going to be the whole point of this place. And uh, yeah, this is going to be quite a design. It is, it is quite small. I got to be honest with you, it is quite small. Uh, but let's go figure out a design here. I have no idea. I actually did not plan out how I want this to look. But in the meantime, I kind of have an idea, hopefully, that the floor will look kind of interesting here. Uh, so let's see. You know what? We might as well cover this up as well. So maybe we can have a border. And then the rest of it can be... Uh, let's go ahead and try something unique here. Uh, let's go with... You know what, we're going to go with dark oak, because that would look really cool with this flooring. And we'll just make a spiral of different different uh, wood here. So we're just going to go with clay and make a spiral and see if this actually looks decent. It might look horrendous, but uh, it's worth giving it a shot. You know, we want to try something different. Actually, I kind of like that. It doesn't look half bad. A lot of contrast looks kind of interesting. Um, but like I said, definitely go ahead and let me know in the comment sections if you even approve of this design. It is really basic. It's nothing special. Don't call me a design wizard because I'm definitely not. Uh, but yeah, it's just, just the start here. All right, we got to definitely add some windows. This cannot be this boring looking. Um, similar with this, these sides. These need to have windows too because it is looking quite boring like that. Um, I'm pretty sure this is symmetrical as well. Let's see. Nice. Okay, cool. Um, now for the back, I don't think we're going to add a window because we have, uh, we're going to have like kind of a kitchen similar, similar to this. It's going to look very similar to this. Um, and that's the goal pretty much. We're going to have it right over here, have some dispensers where we can just pick up some food, which we have our handy dandy farm right across there. Um, and that's pretty much what we're going to use. 
uh, to put our food in here. So that's going to be our food source. Now, when it comes to that bridge, what are we going to do with it? I have no idea. I want it to connect over, which we might do so. Uh, so we'll figure out if that's going to be a design we want to work with. So to replicate this similarly, uh, I did not say that right. To replicate this... Uh, similar to this side. Wow, I can't English right now. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna do something very similar to this. So we have stairs and trap doors. Okay, sweet. Uh, we need stairs. Yeah, this is not good. Uh, do we have a crafting table somewhere around here? We definitely should have a crafting table around here somewhere. Like, how are we messing this up? Crafting table? There we go. I found you. Uh, so we need to make ourselves some stairs, and we're gonna go ahead and use whatever's left of this. Bam. Uh, we need to make ourselves some trap doors. Let's go ahead and craft some of those. I'm pretty sure I have plenty of them, but I'm forgetting where they are right now. So we're just going to deal with this for now. There we go. And I do not know how to make the dispensers right now. I completely forgot. So we might have to research that. Uh, but we're going to do the same thing as I mentioned uh, on the other side. So it's going to go like this. I feel like that's, isn't that too small? I don't know. Now, this is making me not like this design as much here. So we're going to actually take this middle part down and just fill it in, I think, with wood for now. Why is... There's like a spider around here. I don't... And there's some zombies. There definitely has to be a spawner somewhere around us because I keep hearing them spawning. Like, I'm pretty sure there's something under us around here. We'll figure that out eventually. Whoa, what am I doing here? Wrong wood. We have to use the spruce, which I think we used up most of it. Hold on. Let's see what we're doing wrong here. There we go. I was wondering why that looked different. So, I think this is a, a, a decent look for now. Now, one thing I do did realize just now is the fact that this blends in really, really well with the floor. And with that being said, we're going to take it all down again, and we're just going to fill this in with clay because that looks uh, a ton better. So, that's what we're going to do right now. Let's go ahead and, and uh, just chop this all down again. Man, see, this is what happens. Ideas kind of roll in last minute, and it kind of messes up the plans. All right, let's go take this all down. So we're going to finish up the flooring with the gray clay. And I think that will look uh, better than what we had done so far. And this flooring can go as well. There we go. And let's fill in the floor. All right. Sweet. Hold on. Let's fill in this side. All right. That's better. I think that looks tons better than what we had before. Why do I keep messing this up? Like, come on now. What is, it's only been a few months. I haven't, like, come on. We got to step up our game here. It does look kind of like, I don't know, pops out. But we're going to have a carpet maybe in here or something. I don't know. I need some uh, some design ideas, all right? So give me give me uh, uh, suggestions in the comment sections. But let's go ahead and kind of replicate this in a sense. I, I do like this replication. It looks kind of good. I mean... I don't know. I feel like it's nice. Now we can have ourselves something up top here, some chests, uh, dispensers, which we will add. But in the meantime, because we do not have, I don't think we have any dispensers. I'm going to go ahead and give that a shot and see if we have anything just chilling around here. But I doubt that we do. So if we do not have any dispensers left over, uh, we're going to put chests for now in the meantime. Uh, and then eventually we're going to add ourselves the dispensers, uh, which I do not think we have any. We do need item frames. Um, all right. I think we are out of luck on that. Let's see. Yeah, this... Wait, what was that? Oh, we do have six dispensers. Oh, sweet. Okay. Dude, our luck has just changed. Fantastic. Uh, so let's go ahead and put these up here. And we're probably going to fill in this place and make it look kind of nice. I mean, hopefully, it's it's a work of progress. That's for sure. So how we want to do this is let's set up our dispensers right about up top, I think. I don't know if I want them on the side. Maybe we can have, like, a snacks. I don't know, something on the side over there. But in the meantime, this is okay. Um... Hmm, let's see. Maybe, I don't know. I'm not sure if I want those two on the side. We'll figure that out in the meantime. But uh, let's go ahead and add these on the top. I don't know if I want them too high up. So I'm trying to figure this out. I think that's, that's pretty... I mean, it's not even, which does suck. So let's see how we can make this work. Uh, let's do one there. One over there. And then we could do two in the middle like that. I mean, we could even make the whole wall dispensers but that would look kind of strange in my opinion so let's go ahead and take down a few of these let's actually leave those two up here and see how i like that so those two actually no we'll take this down and we'll put them kind of on one side of the corner so we'll do something like one there um let's see let's see probably one over there as well and i think that's pretty 
pretty even for me with this table and everything. So I do like that. We'll probably have some dispensers right here. We'll make a design for that. But let's go ahead and add our item frames on top for now. There we go. And now we gotta wrap these. I think I wanna wrap, I wanna, I don't know. I was thinking of wrapping them in trap, uh, wooden trap doors, but I think that could be actually what it's like kind of, let's see if we can make it manage. There we go. That's gonna be what's gonna be supporting it. Either that or slabs. Let's see how slabs would look. Oh, is it turning night or is it raining? I can't tell right now. Let's see, let's grab these. I think it's turning night. Yeah, yeah, we should definitely go ahead and, and run over and get some sleep somewhere where I left the bed. I cannot remember where I put the bed. Uh, should be somewhere up here, actually. Let's go ahead and, and get some rest quickly. But I'm thinking, I think we might actually go with slabs. And why is the bed over here? I mean, I left it here during one of the streams, but we should definitely move it over. But for now, we're going to leave it here because if we do die, we'll spawn back in this area. So that'll be, that'll be like a, a safety feature for us. Uh, let's go ahead and get ourselves some more stuff from here. Just in case, for example, furnace. Uh, we can get some more wooden trap doors. Oh, slabs, which is just what we needed. Let's get some doors. Oh, we need glowstone. We'll definitely take the glowstone. We'll take the food later on. But let's go and continue to work on this. I think I actually might switch over to slabs instead of trap doors. Because I think we're overusing the trap doors. And it just looks a little bit overwhelming. Even though it looks kind of nice, I feel like it might be overwhelming. Let's give it a shot and see how it looks with the slabs. So we'll put the slabs right about under there. And uh, I, I do like that. Oh, it is kind of tight back here. But I don't think there's going to be a big purpose to it. Um, let's see. Um, and maybe we can add ourselves a chest under it too. All right. Let's do that. Let's take these down. Let's add the slabs right under there. And let's go ahead and see if we can put some fence posts and have it as a support. Let's let's see if this would work. Oh wait, I just realized, yeah, that's not gonna really work. Um if we add the trapdoors one more time, this is like a trial and error process. If we add the trapdoors there and we remove this, I wonder no, they won't work either. Cause I wanna have a chest under here. That way, it kind of looks like there's storage. So let's make some chests so we have a lot of wood with us right now um, and see how this would look. So let's use most of this. Let's go ahead. We have eight of those. We're going to continue. We're just going to make a lot of them because at this point, it doesn't matter. It's good enough to have plenty of them around. So, all right. Let's see how this looks. So I want to have chests sticking right under here, right? I feel like that would look kind of nice. It looks like there's some type of... Uh, process going on where we have food here and we could store up there, but I don't know. I don't know what, what you guys think about that Maybe it just doesn't look right. I don't know Hmm, uh, let's see if we add a now we actually You know what? Hold on that works quite well We are actually gonna do that. All right, sweet. That actually works really well. I, I Like that and I think we could still open the chest even though there's a fence post. Okay, cool. That's going to be the design, and on the top, what we can do is we can add the slabs. That will look kind of cool. All right, I'm about to sneeze right now. Oh, rip. Here we go. Wait. No. Oh, it just went away. Sweet. Nice. All right, so there we go. That looks nice. Uh, we still have to make this look like a kitchen, so we're going to continue to make it all the way to the top, actually. There we go. That looks good. Down here, we can add some type of fridge-looking uh, mechanized. I don't know, something like uh, fridge-looking. Hmm, what can we do? Maybe furnaces, actually. And we'll have ourselves mechanism. Why did I say mechanized? Guys, I cannot speak today. What the heck am I saying? Uh, let's do this. Let's go with that. And then over here, we'll add two furnaces, as so. Looks like a little table. Actually, we should probably put tables here. We'll do something like that. All right, so we have our furnaces on that side. Um, we could probably put ourselves... I think we have a few more dispensers. Okay, cool. So what we could do is we can add some dispensers right on the side here, possibly. Um, so it's like a quick grab-and-go type deal. So let's do that right now. But I do feel like it just takes up a little bit too much space. Hmm, I don't know. Feel like it's a bit too overwhelming, so we're probably gonna take them down and figure out a better spot. We can even put vending machines around the town. That could be really cool, and that would be kind of like sponsored by this. So I do, I do like that a lot. Okay, cool. Let's actually leave that as is. All right, you know what? That looks good. We definitely need to fill up this area too. It kind of looks kind of bland in the background. So let's go ahead and grab some food because we do have this already designed. So we have some chopped lamb. Uh, let's see. I feel like we have some more food just hanging around here somewhere. Uh, obviously, we have a cow farm and we have multiple animals in there. But I think we have some more food that we have in this chest just hanging around. So we might as well grab as much as possible and uh, see what we have just laying around. So we have some steak. 
Uh, we have what else do we have in here? Um, anything else? I thought we had some more, but we do not. All right. Well, there goes that plan. I think we have some other stuff in there, but let's go ahead and get some food. Oh, we're going to have to cook it up and stuff. Oh, man, that's going to take a long process. So what we're going to do is we're going to continue to see if we have anything left around here. I think I saw some watermelon. We could definitely do like a snack for watermelon somewhere around here. There we go. We have watermelons. Uh, we have pumpkin seeds. We don't need to do anything with that. Let's see. Oh, we can actually use some of the spruce fence gates uh, for... For what's it called? Oh, we do need some coal as well. But we can definitely use the uh, spruce for a gate somewhere back there. So we can kind of separate the whole uh, people who work there and the people who don't. So that's something we can definitely do. And let me just clear all this junk out. Oh my gosh, it's overwhelming here. Right, that's good enough. That's good enough. <laughs> Let's see, anything in here? We definitely have to have some food here. Okay, so we have some fish, raw salmon. Fantastic. Got some carrots. Uh, we're going to have to cook all that anyways. And that's pretty much all the food we have. Wow, that's a bummer. Uh, we're definitely gonna have to fill up that place um, in the upcoming episodes. But for now, that should do just to show you guys how this would work. So, uh, obviously... Oh, let me think this through a little bit now. Um, we could actually make a mechanism where things can go up into the dispenser. But uh, if we do that, I'm gonna do some redstoning. But you know what? We'll, we'll work on that. We'll do something related to that. So, in the meantime, let's go fill up this area. So, we'll do, let's start off with watermelon in this one. Okay, we'll do some watermelon in there. Uh, let's put, I think we have some steak, right? I saw a little bit of steak. Yeah, there we go. So, we'll put some steak in this one. Perfect. And in here, we'll add some fish. So, we're got to cook up our salmon, which is actually a pretty good fish right there. Some good tasting fish. And you know what? I kind of like it. We definitely need some more variety. It can't just be looking like this. So, uh, now that I kind of, hmm, let's see. How would it look? Oh, wait a minute. I think this will look kind of cool if some of the dispensers were actually right on here. But because of the slab... Oh, yes, it does work. Ooh, that looks kind of interesting. I don't know if, if, if that works or that doesn't work. I feel like maybe it's too much. Who knows? Let's go ahead and uh, see what you guys think. You know what? No, I like that. We're going to give it a shot. I think it looks kind of cool. So let's put our salmon in here. Take Actually, we'll leave all those in there because we have probably one cooking up. And then we'll put some carrots down here. Let's go ahead and grab some carrots. Perfect. And I think we have some leftover bread. Yeah, we do. We'll put some bread for now. We're just going to use whatever we have in our inventory in the meantime. And then we'll stock it up with some more stuff eventually. Going to keep some of that. Put the salmon over there. And boom. And over here, we'll just add the lamb pork chop. So, all right. I kind of like this. This looks kind of cool. Much better than before because... Before, I had to go, like I showed you, searching around chests to find if we have any food and such, and that was just a pain. It was never working out too well for us. So, uh, And we do have a fishing shop as well. Well, pretty much not a fishing shop, but a uh, fish AFK farm, which can actually be used as a fish farm. So that can actually produce, which is right over there. So that can produce the goods for here. We have our farm over there, and we also have some crops down there. So we definitely have to expand our farming resources for sure. So that's something we're definitely going to do 100% so uh, look forward to that but so far I'm quite happy I don't think we're gonna add chairs because I don't really think there's a need for it and uh, I mean I don't know it looks nice to definitely have some but I don't know we'll, we'll figure that out we do have to add our uh, fences here our fence post so let's go ahead and oh not those our fence gates not fence post where are they there we go let's actually grab that and boom looking pretty good I'm pretty happy with this really basic I think it looks good. Uh, now we do have to add some windows here, and I don't think I have any actual windows on me. But let's actually open this up too. This looks quite boring. We can't leave it like this. Let's make this look much better. Give it some light. Oh my gosh, this place looked really dark before. But man, it's coming to life. I am really, really happy with this so far. Uh, this room is smaller than this one. This is actually a little bit bigger. Uh, but I'm pretty happy with this so far. Let's go ahead and work on this passageway since it is uh, one of the last things I wanted to get done. Uh, we do want to add some glowstone as well. We can actually do something interesting here. We could actually have something hanging from the top. Uh, but yeah, we'll work on that eventually. Let's go ahead and finish up this last dying project, uh, which is to finish up this pathway. I don't know. I find it kind of unique. It looks kind of interesting. It's something different. Um, so let's go ahead. I think we're going to go with slabs. I don't like to, I don't know if I wanted to replace these with dark oak because it feels weird. I don't know. I'm not a big fan of the jungle wood here. I mean, although it doesn't look bad, I don't know if it's just 
maybe too bright, too much contrast, who knows. But for now, because we have some jungle wood, we're just going to continue the pattern. And then we'll make do with any changes we want to do in the future. Uh, let's make a crafting table real quick. Wait, hold on. Um, I thought there was an easier way to craft things before. Oh, there we go. That's another way, but whatever. Not really looking to do that right now. How do we put this back? I don't want the book. There we go. Uh, we'll just throw a crafting table up here. And what, there's like a horse. <laughs> that just took that captured my eye right now. <laughs> captured my attention. All right, let's make some slabs. Not trapdoors, slabs. There we go. Let's, actually, we need a bit more. Now, by the look of this, I don't know if these are slabs. I think some of these are stairs. Let's see. Oh, those are full. Oh, man. See, we can't do that here. Oh, my God. Why is there a creeper here? What are you doing, creeper? Like, this, the, the food store is closed, dude. It's still in, in, like, it's still being built. Like, yeah, I know you're trying to order, but, like, come on, dude. Like, <laughs> like you take it up. All, and, he's, and he's trapped in there. Guys, this is our new, um, yeah, this is pretty much our new employee. He's a creeper, so if you don't... Uh, you know, if you get him ticked off, he'll he'll kind of go big boom. So that's going to mess up our plans here. So how are we going to do this? Uh, he's trapped in there, and we're just going to leave him there for now because I do not want to bother. Never mind. He quit. <laughs> he quit. He's out of there. All right, let's 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 actually... Oh, it's turning night. That's why he spawned in. This, that's kind of interesting, Creeper. You really messed up my plans here. You really did. All right, let's back off. Back off. I don't even think we're going to have time to work on this bridge because of this Creeper. Jeez, creeper. Why? All right, so let's just try to finish this up before anything bad happens, uh, which I don't know if we're going to be able to finish this up. But in the meantime, we're going to make a quick little path and hope for the best that this works out, okay? That's just my plan right now. And I don't, I don't even know how this is going to look from the top, but it could look actually kind of cool. But there we go. We're just going to do a, a really quick, simple path because as you can see, uh, we're coming close to the end of today's episode. But you know what? That actually looks really cool for some apparent reason. It just feels unique. I don't know why. Like, we're going to have our other designs uh, coming down here. We're going to have probably like, uh, what's it called? Some glowstone. Oh, this is looking really good. If you guys enjoyed today's episode, don't forget to go ahead and hit that like button for more Minecraft Survival Let's Play. I do apologize once more for being so delayed with uploads. But as you can see, the return is here. Uh, if you guys want to see more, don't forget to hit the like button. Let's go and see if we can smash 100 likes. I know it's a big target, but uh, I want to see if you guys still support this series. And if you are new to this series and channel, don't forget to subscribe as well and hit that notification bell. Other than that, guys, stay tuned for more Minecraft Survival Let's Play and other series. Peace out. My name is Alexon, and stay foxy.